Meet Dr. Gladys McGarry, famously recognized as the mother of holistic medicine. Dr. Gladys revolutionized the medical profession in the United States. She has helped transform the lives of thousands and continues to do so at the age of 102. If anyone knows the secrets to a long and healthy life, it's a 102-year-old holistic physician. And in her latest book, The Well-Lived Life, she dishes it all out. Join us in today's video as we share Dr. Gladys's dietary, exercise, and mindset tips. Stay till the end so you don't miss her top six secrets to a well-lived life. Let's begin with her diet. Dr. Gladys has dedicated her entire life to healthy living and helping others do the same. That's why it's surprising to find out that this centenarian doesn't follow any strict dietary plans. Instead, she advises others to eat a balanced diet and find what works best for them. Dr. Gladys has traveled the world. She was born in India, where the food is entirely different from what she was later exposed to in the United States during her college years. This means Gladys has sampled everything from tandoori chicken to hamburgers. Having said that, she does have one strong recommendation when it comes to diet. Eat food as fresh as possible. Living foods, she calls them. She says eating a lot of fresh vegetables and meats that agree with you is an excellent way to foster vibrant health. It's hard to argue with that. Fresh vegetables are loaded with essential vitamins and minerals. These nutrients support the immune system and promote optimal growth and development. Most fresh vegetables are low in calories and high in fiber, making them an excellent choice for weight management and a diverse microbiome. Meat is a significant source of high-quality protein and essential amino acids. Although not all meats are the same, please remember that sourcing is the most important factor when determining the quality of your meat. Protein is crucial for building tissues and supporting muscle growth. This makes it especially beneficial for anyone engaged in physical activity, athletes and those looking to preserve muscle mass as they age. After years of tasty adventures, Gladys has found what works best for her body. Her typical breakfast consists of raisin bran with skim milk and a glass of prune juice. Opting for a whole grain version of raisin bran with minimal added sugars is recommended for maximum nutritional benefit. She usually has a salad for lunch and favors soup for dinner. This ensures that she fully digests her meal and feels nice and light as she prepares to sleep. Soups offer endless possibilities for customization and creativity. You can experiment with different flavors, spices, and ingredients, making it an enjoyable and versatile dinner option. It allows you to incorporate a wide range of vegetables, proteins, and grains into your meal, ensuring dietary diversity. Homemade soups are definitely recommended over canned soups that may contain higher levels of sodium, preservatives, and unhealthy fats. Finally, Dr. Gladys says it's important to always bless your food, infuse it with love, and be thankful for it. Next, let's talk about her exercise routine. All her life, Gladys has been moving and exercising a lot, even when she didn't want to. Her family lived in the Himalayas, and she recalls having to climb up and down so many steps just to go between school and home. The habit of stair climbing never left her, and at 102, she still climbs a lot of stairs to help her stay fit. She said when building her house, she purposely put her bedroom upstairs so she would have to climb up and down at least once per day. Stair climbing is a practical exercise option that is readily available and requires no equipment. Whether it's climbing stairs at home, work, or in public spaces, this is a workout that can easily be included into your daily routine. It's not just good for strengthening the lower body. Stair climbing is excellent for balance and coordination and also for cardiorespiratory health. But that's not all Gladys does to remain fit and sharp. The mother of holistic medicine says she always tries to meet her daily target of 3,800 steps. That's equivalent to walking about 2 miles, 3.2 kilometers every day. That's way more steps than the average American takes in a day. And this woman is 102. Walking is a simple, low-impact exercise. It's a natural movement that most people do, 
regardless of age or fitness level. To maximize the benefits of walking, aim for a brisk pace that elevates your heart rate. Start with the duration and intensity that suits your fitness level and gradually increase as you become more comfortable. As with any exercise program, it's advisable to consult with a healthcare professional before starting. The icing on Gladys's exercise cake is her beloved tricycle. You'll see her cycling every other afternoon. Gladys's incredible mindset has kept her going for so long. Can you believe that at 102, she has a 10-year plan? Gladys has a goal for developing a living village, a sort of conscious, intentional community where everyone within it helps each other. She knows she's not as energetic as she used to be, so she's not shy about asking for help. She has her kids, neighbors, and friends who are more than happy to help her around the house. And Gladys happily reciprocates in kind, where she can. Okay, now the big moment you've been waiting for. Let's look at Dr. Gladys's six secrets to a long and happy life. 1. Spend your energy wildly. Gladys has spent most of her life traveling the world, helping as many people as she can to heal. At the age of 84, she traveled to Afghanistan to teach rural women safer birthing practices, resulting in a 47% decrease in infant mortality rates in that area. Even now, Gladys still does consultations, staying true to her holistic approach to medicine. Whatever your particular gift, Gladys recommends giving it abundantly. 2. All life needs to move. She says you need to move spiritually mentally and physically to help let go of the trauma and overcome diseases and other roadblocks as evident in her exercise routine gladys has never stopped moving physically she has also always moved mentally overcoming the challenge of dyslexia as a child to become one of the most important figures in modern medicine number three you are here for a reason gladys believes everyone needs to find their juice as she calls it that inner essence that drives you and keeps you oriented in your life's purpose. She believes that purpose is what gives life meaning and drives a person's growth. Gladys says, if you stop growing, you die. She also mentions the importance of being flexible with your purpose, so that when it's fulfilled, you can find another that brings as much joy and happiness as the first. 4. You are never alone. She says it's important to build a community that's meaningful to you, one that supports you and helps you grow. When Gladys is not keeping busy knitting or consulting, she talks to her friends and family. She believes a loving community promotes happiness and a long life. 5. Everything is your teacher. Gladys always finds a way to learn from every experience particularly the painful moments and the setbacks. She says she learned this at a very young age after she completely flopped on stage at a school play. Learning from bad experiences helps shift your perception and impacts the way others perceive you. 6. Love is the most potent medicine. Above all, Dr. Gladys believes that everything you do will elicit better results if done with love. She believes healing can only happen when love is present. It's equally important to love yourself as it is to love others. If you enjoyed this video on the 102-year-old doctor, then you won't want to miss our next video on the 97-year-old female gymnast. Who is she? Only one way to find out. Hit the subscribe button so you never miss any tips on all the ways you can stay fit and healthy at any age.